Hey everyone, so today I will show you how to access the CUNY Virtual Desktop. Um, first, we will start from CUNY Blackboard. And if we go to the left hand side here, we click on Software Information. We scroll a little bit down to the middle um, resource and click on the link. And this will take us to a Google document where we can click on this link to go to the virtual desktop page and this will connect us to the remote desktop depending on your operating system you'll download the appropriate client I have the windows running on my machine and I've already opened it so this is what it will look like and then you click new server up here our URL will be vdi.cuny.edu we will get this dialog page and just click accept. We enter our username. We'll get the, a list of all the available virtual desktops. We want to click on SPSS version 23. So now it's currently spinning up a virtual desktop for us on the CUNY servers. And we will give it some time to load. Once you are once you have loaded the desktop, you will see SPSS open up. We will get this dialog box, which will ask us for any recent files that we want to open or if we want to open another file. We're going to click on open another file and then OK. The quirk for using this virtual desktop is that there are two different file systems that we are working with. The local disk on the virtual desktop will actually contain a folder with our username which won't have much in it and down here we will see a network folder that has the name of our local computer in this case my computer's name is Hunter PC we can click on this to access our local files now this may take a while since it's using the network to display all of my files. You click on documents and go into the file where your data is contained. And we will open up this SAV file. about um, Unicode encoding um, you'll likely get this window just click yes on it and that will load your data set on your remote desktop uh, thanks for watching